More than a century ago, an Australian painter lived among the elements on a remote island of the coast of France. He worked side by side with Monet. He was a lifelong friend of Van Gogh and Rodin. And he opened the eyes of Matisse to color. John Russell was one of the great Impressionists. His story has everything. The fabulous, handsome hero. There's the love affair with the beautiful woman, Mariana. There are the exotic places, Paris and Berlioz. And then there's tragedy. You want desperately for him to get his moment in the spotlight. John Peter Russell is one of the great Australian artists that no one's ever heard of. There's this almost mythical or fabled land in Europe off the coast of France called Belle Isle, which means beautiful island. It had this incredible appeal, this wonderful romance and a physical beauty that attracted some of the world's greatest artists. Russell did do his best work here. I mean, he knew the place. Something about the place attracted him. I mean, you know, when we first arrived, wow, you do. You think, cool, this is amazing. The idea of going there in the flesh is actually kind of confronting because it, it seems to have been almost created by the vision of those artists, and of Russell especially, who owned it so well by harnessing the, uh, the landscape there and the elements there so beautifully. I do think artists are drawn to particular places, and I think places will often reflect a part of themselves, a part of their personality. Particularly the Côte Sauvage is such a rugged landscape, and you know, these sheer drops and cliffs, it's not a landscape for the timid. So you get a sense of Russell's boldness and his character. <laughs> 